Hi, I'm Paul from Production Expert. In this series of videos, we're looking at how to produce some double track vocals in Studio One. So in the first video, we looked at how to set up recording takes to layers. And in the second video, we recorded the vocal and we've chosen the actual layers that we're gonna be working with. So this part of the video, we're gonna be looking at more of the production side of things. And I'm gonna be concentrating on the tuning side of things. So the way that I like to tune is to tune with multiple plugins. Now that might sound a bit weird as you do only need one plugin into tune. So what I like to use is Auto-Tune and Melodyne. Now I use Melodyne for the heavy lifting and Auto-Tune just to bring in the fine details. The reason why I do this is because I don't want either plugin working too hard and I find that I get much more natural results by using these two plugins. So now let's just copy Auto-Tune into the first slot in my inserts. I'm using Universal Audio Apollos for this and as Antara's Auto-Tune is available in the UAD platform, I'm gonna copy that over to the first slot in my inserts. Now, let's solo that vocal and have a quick listen. But then you build me up like thunder to bring me down. So already that's tuning it far too hard, but we need to tell it what key we're in. And we're in E flat major. Now you can choose the input type here, and I'm going to keep it on soprano. And let's have a listen now. But then you build me up like thunder. So it's still tuning too hard. So I'm just going to bring back the retune speed here to about 63. But then you build me up like thunder to bring me down, bring me down. And let's oh, hear that in the track. So as you can hear, that's doing a great job of the tuning. Now, the next thing I'm gonna do is to use Melodyne. Now, as we have ARA2 technology inside of Studio One, so I just click on audio here and choose edit with Melodyne. Now that brings up Melodyne in my ARA window, and I'm just gonna shrink Melodyne just so I can see a little bit more information on the screen. So all I've gotta do here is just to tune up a couple of different vocals. So I'm gonna choose my note separation tool, and I'm just gonna tidy this note up here. But then you me up like Thunder to bring me down, bring me down. Oh, how the curtains close for us. Should we take our bow? Take our bow. Oh. So there, I'm just going to chop that and just tidy that bit up there. Oh, always oh, you, 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 only you, you, you. Could make me feel, make me feel like something real. But then you build me up like So we've got this little problem here where we've got double breath. So I'm going to grab my amplitude tool and I'm just going to bring that right down. Made me feel, made me feel like something real. But then you build me up like thunder to bring me down. Bring me down just to bring me down. Now luckily Abby is a great singer and I hardly have to touch her vocals. But if I was using a singer that wasn't as good as Abby, I'd be going through and just correcting all these little nodes here. So now let's have a listen to the vocal. But there you be. So as you can hear, we've got a little timing problem there and I'm gonna fix that in the next video. So I'm Paul from Production Expert. I hope you guys got something out of that and I'll see you next time. Cheers.